Welcome to this another lecture on fundamentals of image processing. So in this uh, tutorial, we're going to have a look upon the region of interest. So in image processing, region of interest is a pretty fundamental concept and it is very important as well in our upcoming lectures as well. So basically what we mean by region of interest is that whenever we see any portion which is important to our use, then we extract that for our particular use. And that is what we call as the region of interest. So it's basically certain area or any sort of boundaries which we are interested upon. Now, when we see in a person face uh, might be their eyes could be a region of interest. So if you're interested in extracting the portion of eyes, then that can be considered as a part of the region of interest and any sort of other figures, which you can see in this slide as well. So basically it's uh, used in the image segmentation process where we actually segment a particular portion at that time, the region of interest is very useful to us. So in this tutorial, we're going to have a look on how do we extract the region of interest from our spider notebook. And this is basically, it will be a kind of coding session in which we will be learning that how do we extract a particular region of interest using the functions on OpenCV. So let's go and have a look at our spider notebook itself. Now I am finally onto my ID. So firstly, I will need to import the required libraries. So I am going to import my CV2 and I'm going to import my numpy and then I will need to pass on the variable which will store the location of my image so we have embraid function for that and then I will need to pass the location of my image so in my case this one is my image and I will just go and copy the path of my image into a string and then I will need to name my image which is person.jpg so this is how you copy the path of your image onto your IDE and then you need to view this so for that you have imshow function and let's give the name original and then let's uh, keep the image portion here I and mean in the path where we have stored the image you should pass this and then you need to use the wait key and then you will also need to destroy your windows before this uh, let's go and just uh, resize our image so you have for resize you have cv2 dot resize and you need to pass the image and then you need to give a particular dimension so in my case let's keep it as uh, 600 comma 600 so now let's go and view this all right so now you see that our image has been displayed now uh, in selecting the region of interest uh, we need to firstly extract that so let's uh, see how do we do that so for selecting the region of interest we need to open our paint so once you open the paint app just go to your open section and open that particular picture so once you do this now go and resize this onto this dimension which is 600 comma 600 for that you have the resize option here just click on that just go on to pixels just uncheck this maintain aspect ratio and then type 600 is to 600 once you do this your image has been resized now the width and height of this image is equal to this one right so that it becomes easier for us to extract our particular region of interest now what we do is that we select the region of interest so let's say that i'm uh, the region of interest in this face is the eye itself okay so what i'm going to do is that i am going to select that particular boundary so how am i going to do that i'm just going to select this rectangle and then i need to extract this particular okay let's say this one is my region of interest okay this much portion so now what you do is that you need to select the coordinates of this particular frame okay so for that you just need this coordinates and this coordinates the point of this one and this one okay you don't need these both you just need first and this one so where do you get the coordinates here so if you see this you can just notice in this particular section that your uh, coordinates has been displayed so if i see uh, click on any of the pictures you can see the coordinates being located so i will just go there and just click on this particular portion so i am getting 210 comma 198 so i'm getting 210 210 comma 198 let me cross check it if i'm getting the same 
right so uh, you just need to uh, keep the so 209 comma 198 209 comma 198 okay so you just need to be precise with the coordinates itself and then uh, the fourth one so i need to use this particular coordinate right uh, the fourth one so this one is my fourth one so in this case uh, you are seeing 416 comma 313 okay 416 comma 315 416 comma 315 so this is what your coordinates are now once you get this coordinates now the first point 209 comma 198 can be displayed as x1 comma y1 and this one 416 comma 315 is our x2 comma y2 now you need to write the ROI in this format so ROI you need to write this in the format like this so you just need to write it firstly you just need to give the y1 is to y2 ratio and then you need to pass the x1 is to x2 ratio so once you do this now uh, let's go and type our ROI let me just delete this portion and just go and pass our ROI so in ROI in my case is image and then you need to pass the y1 is to y2 coordinate so what is y1 it's uh, 198 is to 315 right 198 is to 315 and x1 is to x2 is 209 is to 416 y1 is to y2 right y1 is to y2 and x1 is to x2 x1 is to x2 this is what i have done simply because you just need to write this in this particular format now once i do this now this is my region of interest okay now how do i view this so for that you just need to go there and just use cv2.im show and just name the windows as region of interest and then pass this particular variable which is ry which is storing your storing your region of interest in my case the region of interest was this right so i will basically get this portion extracted and then you need to pass the roi now let's go and run this and let's see if it has extracted or not so yeah basically you can see that it has extracted your region of interest now so this is how you get the region of your interest so what we do is that we just go and just import the required libraries we just go and resize our image and then we open that image into paint and just resize with what we have done here right and then we just select the particular region of interest using rectangle and use the coordinates of this one and this one and then just write it in the format of y1 is to y2 and x1 is to x2 and you just simply view it so this is how we do it i hope you have understood how do we extract the region of interest thank you for watching my video